Big Section 1 baseball matchup on Thursday at Mamaronick. Fox Lane and their ace, Tyler Renz, the right-hander headed to St. John's. Of course, going to bring in a little extra media and some scouts for the senior who entered 3-0. and And this won't be a good pitching duel and also some good defense. The other way, diving catch made Thomas Griffith on the catch in right field. It would be scoreless in the middle of the second. Tyler Renz, he was... Really good early on. He had a little some control issues, but gets a strikeout there to end the first. Later, in the second inning, ground ball to short. Play made over to first. Foxes kept off the board early on in this game as Nate Siegel was dealing for the Tigers. Renz, Renz is in trouble, but got out of it with the strikeout. Big K there. He had three strikeouts through two innings. Later though, runner on third. Tried to pick him off, play at the plate. The run scores, no hits for Mamaronic, but a one run lead in the second. And then later, ball driven the other way. That would find a gap, a double for Chris Garrett, who would get to second. He would later get to third as the Foxes tried to protect that one nothing lead. Renz got a little wild in this game in the second inning. Pass ball behind home plate on the wild pitch. Play at the plate, they said that Garrett never touched home. The out was made. Ends the second inning. Mamaronek with a 1-0 lead. Top of the third. Foxes get on the board. Brad Patterson with a runner on. Two runners on, actually. Logan Mamola would score on the Patterson single the other way. Tied the game up at one apiece. And then later in the inning, the Foxes strike for another. Line drive through the hole into left field. That was John Zernick with the line drive single. Scores a run. Foxes take a 2-1 lead. Zernick was 3-for-3 three three on the afternoon. We talked about Renz having some control issues, but that didn't last all that long. Found his groove in the fourth inning. Gets a strikeout there on the breaking ball, and then blowing fastballs by the Marinick hitters. One of nine strikeouts on the day for the senior. Later, another strikeout for Renz. Renz mowing him down as Fox Lane would take a 2-1 lead into the sixth. And then they'd add some insurance runs. That is Cooper first with an RBI single. One of two runs that the Foxes would tack on in the sixth inning. More than enough for Renz. Renz pitch count got a little high in this game, but a nasty breaking ball right there to record the out. She said he had nine strikeouts, only the one walk. Both runs that Mamaronic would earn would be on Renz, but he was fired up. As he came out, he was one out into the seventh inning before being removed. And the Tigers would take advantage. Jordan Schinderman laces an RBI double to left. That would score a run, make it 4-2 Fox Lane. Tigers would put two on with two outs, winning run at the plate. But it would end with a strikeout. Foxes win it 4-2. They hold on for the victory. They improve to 8-2 on the season and are one of the front runners in Class AA in Section 1.